Su, in this video we are gonna discuss about the special monsters, and how they actually belong to the evil summoner, and we start the discussion by addressing the most obvious method of getting summoning stones, that being by the treasure gnomes, and if we read gnomes description, we will find that the gnomes actually steal these stones from other summoners, which if you read evil summoners, description, is actually her, as it states that gnomes took her summoning stones, and now she wants them back, and that also explains why, she is left with only golems and rocks, and that is because, these golems never were her monsters, but she's just using her powers to make them alive, and also giving them elemental powers, and this also explains why special monsters need a lot of money to level up, as they are just like exotic pets, and if you ever owned any, you know they take more care and maintenance, hence increasing the cost of raising them up, and same thing implies to evil summoner fighting us, since there are only three people other than gnome who have summoning stones, being, us, traitor, and monitor, and that's the reason why evil summoner fights us, and also why traitor and monitor don't appear in evil summoner map but do in all others, Hence gnomes, traitor, and monitor all are banned by evil summoner to ever come to her map. And she fights us to take our beloved chest, because we took her beloved stones. And this proves another thing that, evil summoner is not actually evil, but is just branded as one. So yes, that's the real reason why special monsters belong to evil summoner and how she's not actually the evil summoner, but a good summoner. And with that said, this theory ends. Today, I wasn't in much mood of doing anything, so I chose this small topic. But I hope you liked this video. Thanks for watching, just keep grinning and aura is mine.